So let me show you how to find the proposed tower developments. You just go to Google and type in City of Kelowna Current Developments and it says development permits medallion wireless, wireless a development permit application to facilitate a tel to communications tower so and that's the city planner Andrew Ferguson. So we go to view details and it now says the file closed. That's when the landowner says that he wants to withdraw the application. So um, here's the development documents, and you can just click on that. So here's the PDF. You can see here, this is, are the drawings. And, and look at this right here. The manufacturer is Huawei. Huawei, Huawei Air, Huawei, Huawei Air, Huawei, Huawei Air. Uh, so, and there's a GPS of some sort. Uh, we'll go down further here. Now this is the installation, so this would be at a very remote part of the property. So now see, they were going to place that right over here, so it would be that corner of the land. So let me just zoom out a bit and you can kind of see logistically where that would be. Now there is a number of these applications and I wanted to add here, this is all farmland. Uh, which is wonderful. So it kind of creates an interesting situation because there's a grove of trees, the farmland's above it, but they do need coverage along this large thoroughfare. And uh, if they don't have coverage, then um, the, it's like a uh, Christmas, one of the old Christmas tree lights. If you had a bulb that was broken somewhere, it would then, the, the whole thing, that's kind of how 5G works. It has to be uh, interconnected and closely spaced together. So you can kind of see here how strategically there would be a large problem if all of this farmland uh, around here would then uh, kind of get in the way of uh, transmitting. So this is kind of logistical where this is. And what's lovely about this is that these uh, tend to be Sikh uh, farm owners and they're a very close-knit community and the two that have gone down so far as I've mentioned earlier was Spears Road and East Kelowna Road they happen to be very well respected gentlemen in their community and it uh, from what I've heard that uh, everyone really does value their opinions so the fact that they uh, took down two uh, cellular antennas is quite encouraging I wanted to show you what exactly we're dealing with with these uh, cell towers so this is above view looking down. This is a 305 millimeter cable tray. Chain link fence, barbed wire top, um, compound layout. Okay, so this is that. Now, I uh, just wanted, this is where the antenna itself would go. Look at all of these antennas. Huawei, Huawei, whatever your feelings are about Huawei, uh, with regards to the controversy over the Chinese surveillance and spying um, of North American citizens through their Huawei technology and why it has been uh, banned in United States and United Kingdom. Um, so that, that itself would appear to be a little controversial. Now here is a close-up. See, that's a door right there. So that's like a little building. Uh, and uh, this is the tower. So this is the base of the tower. Again, chain link fence, barbed wire top. And then look at how small that is. So that's that would be a person. And this goes all the way up 100 feet, uh, lightning rod, and then that array of antennas that you saw there. Uh, so that is uh, the schematics. And what's really awesome about this is whenever there is a tower proposal, they must submit the drawings. And what's really nice about that is all it needs is community opposition uh, to have this stopped. 